Time for another collection update. Been buying a few things off eBay to start with, as usual. And uh, the first game is Aliens on the Ricochet label, and that was two quid exactly, including postage. And also picked up off Ricochet Dan Dare, the first one, and that was one pound seventy something. And two games which were fifty pence each plus postage from the same seller. That's Continental Circus and Rapid Fire. And the other games I bought were from a site called Retro Gaming World. And they all these games were £1.99 each. And the bonus for me was that the store uh, is actually based out of a shop in Stafford. Now, they don't actually have the stock on display. It's actually a regular modern computer shop. Uh, but they, I was able to... Uh, Thanks to my lovely girlfriend Anna, uh, she went and picked up the stock from Stafford, so I didn't have to pay any postage. So all these were one pound ninety nine each. And I'll go through them quickly. Uh, these are quite generally quite rare ones, uh, so it was good to get them for these prices. So we've got Micro Mouse, Phantom of the Asteroids, Judge Dread, Grand Prix Tennis. And we've also got Skate Rock Simulator, Black Witch, Fist 2, Rogue, and Jeff Minter's Revenge 2, otherwise known as Revenge of the Mutant Camels, I think. And the last one I got from there is a, a particularly special one, um, and it's actually a free promotional tape. Uh, so there's no uh, inlay for it, this is what it looks like. And on one side of that is uh, a rolling demo of some of the games done by the Darling Brothers. Uh, and on the other side is a game that was never released at retail, a game called Aqua by Mr Chip Software. So that's uh, quite a rare thing to get hold of, so I was quite pleased to get that for £1.99. Uh, seldom seen, in fact I've not seen it at all on eBay. So uh, overall that now takes me to about 140 games. And the net price is round about a quid still, so still going well on that score. That leaves about 75 games to collect, I think. 